Between 1932 and 1934, millions of Ukrainians died of starvation in the Holodomor. According to historians, the death toll from the man-made famine reached its peak in June 1933. At the time, 28,000 people were dying almost every day. That's more than 1,000 every hour and one person every three seconds. There was an extremely large concentration of losses during the first six months of 1933, from January through June. The Holodomor is different from other famines in history, due to the maximum concentration of a large number of deaths over quite a short period. 90% of the losses happened during these six months. Demographer Natalia Levchuk studies the aftermath of the Holodomor. Together with her colleagues from Harvard, she has developed an interactive atlas According to the calculations, the largest number of deaths occurred in the Kiev and Kharkiv regions. More than one million people died there during that time period. A brief analysis of the situation in these regions showed that this is where the largest wave of anti-collectivization protests took place in 1930. In 1931, the government imposed the largest grain collection plan for these regions. So the famine there started at the beginning of 1932. Then, despite the reduction of the plan, they fell behind. And they suffered more than others from repressive punitive measures. It's a scientific indicator of the fact that the famine was man-made. It's hard to determine the exact number of Holodomor victims. Stalin's regime destroyed many findings and documents from that time. According to the findings of the Ukrainian Institute of Demography and American scientists, almost 4 million Ukrainians died then. That was 13% of the population. These estimates are based on a so-called demographic reconstruction. We calculated the losses from excess mortality, the difference between the actual number of victims of the famine and the hypothetical number of deaths, which would be expected if there was no famine. The excess is 3.9 million people. A quarter of them were children under the age of 10. Estimates also suggest around 600,000 Ukrainians weren't even born. Reported by Lubov Zadorozhna, UATV.